Welcome to another Rust video. Today I went solo on a vanilla server and we're going to get my first Rex riches on Rust. Now keep in mind I only have around 50 hours. If you guys want more Rust videos in the future, make sure that you have liked the video. Let's aim for 100 likes. Also make sure to subscribe to almost any future Rust videos. In this video we are going to give away a Rust skin which is a redemption face mask. If you want to win this skin, make sure that you've liked, subscribed and comment something below. And if you are a channel member, we also have a higher chance of winning. Before we dive into the video, I want to introduce you to today's sponsor. Are you guys trying to start your own Rust servers? Then look no further than Pine Hosting. With Pine Hosting, you can set up your very, very easily and they offer high performance servers and the interface is super user friendly. That's very easy to learn. They also have locations scattered across the world and their pricing is very cheap. Pine Hosting also caters to a lot of different games that include Ark, Minecraft and Unturned. A standout feature is the ability to install plugins and mods just by clicking once. If you already have a server with another provider you don't have to worry because they will provide personalized help to help you move your servers. If you're ready to start your own Rust servers don't miss the link in the description below and be sure to use the code LDG for a huge 30% discount and let's get straight into the video. Alright boys we are in Rust solo. Completely naked, we have a rock, three snowballs, and a torch. Insane start. So this server is vanilla, it's my first, technically my second time doing a video on Rust. First time was just me trying out the basics, but today I actually want progress. Today I do want a pretty nice base down, perhaps even try to get myself some raids. Now I'm still learning the game a lot, to be completely honest, I still have around 50 hours. So in this video we're going to do... From absolutely nothing to getting ourselves hopefully some high tier guns. Last time the only gun I got was a revolver. But today we're gonna progress through much, much, much more. So we're gonna just start farming sulfur, wood. I don't even know why I'm getting sulfur this early to be honest. But 100% sure we're gonna need it anyway. Oh, wait, there's a guy. Alright, well my guy's hazmat and everything. And he doesn't even see me, bro! Oh, I'm just gonna chase him down and I'm gonna try to kill him. I could just throw a rock at him, but... Yeah, that's not gonna work. He's gonna keep running and I'm just gonna keep chasing him. Maybe he'll lead me to his base. Oh, he stopped! Oh, there we go. Easy. Hit him. Hit him again. Bro, there's no way I just downed him. Bro, wraps to riches. Oh, he actually has some stuff. Scrap, frags, HQM, chainsaw. Bro, there is no way that just happened. There is no way we got a water pipe. Yeah, he had a... Uh... Bro, there is no way we did that. That's hilarious. We got pistol ammo, so... Alright, well, we're gonna run off. Hopefully it doesn't lift close and I'm just gonna build myself a base then. Rack search is... There we go. Full vanilla rock. It's water pipe hazmat. Scrap. That's hilarious, man. Alright, there's a few perils here. Let's just start farming them. Alright, so I've been farming for a lot, got myself quite good loot actually, and I found myself uh, a thing is gonna be a good base spot. There we go, we got ourselves a building planner. For now I'm not gonna build anything crazy, we'll build like a 2x1 and a triangular at the side right over here. Get ourselves some walls as well, I think it's gonna be a good location though. We're not too far, there we go, we got ourselves the hammer, let's just dump that. Alright, let's start doing the walls. Yeah, nothing too crazy right now, man. There we go, get ourselves doors as well. Now, we still need more wood, actually. We don't even have enough. All right, let's just farm more wood. There's nobody around by the looks of it. So you can farm in peace. There's a few people on the server. Now, I didn't really join, like, an, a very active server since I'm still trying to get used to actually getting my first good, decent gun. That's not a revolver. But first things first, obviously, we're gonna have to have a base. We're close to... I'm pretty sure it's train yard. And to the lighthouse as well. But I will try to get myself a tier 3 as well today. I think that would be a pretty nice goal to have. There we go. We got ourselves a tool cupboard. Let's craft that bad boy. Put our bed in here too. There we go. Call it home. There's animals outside, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just animals. I don't know where they are though. We can get ourselves fat for a uh, furnace. But yeah, I don't really know where they are. Honestly, let's just finish the base. I'll put the TC right over there. There we go. Let's put ourselves some wood so that it stops decaying. But yeah, I guess in this video you're just gonna see how a 50 hour solo thinks. If I do any mistakes, just let me know. I would love to learn more about this game. Any small tips that you guys may have. Let's get ourselves an armored door. I mean a normal door. We can get ourselves a key lock too. Because I'm gonna be alone this whole time. 
And let's just start upgrading. I can actually make some stone buildables, but for now, let's just do it wood. Yeah, let's just start doing stone route of wood. And after this, we're gonna farm, and then after that, very soon, we'll start doing some good runs. I made something into metal. I genuinely don't know what I did. And yeah, base is half wood, half metal, half wood, half stone, and one metal. We can actually still upgrade a lot of the base into stone. We still have quite a lot. Alright, let's put the door. There we go. Base is technically sealed. Let's get ourselves the key lock. And there we go. Base is built. Lovely. I don't know if I'm gonna run around with the water pipe, actually. I should probably just make myself a few bows. Not risk the only gun I have. Alright, yeah, we're out of stone. We're gonna farm next. We're gonna do a lot of farming. Back in base from a pretty decent farm run. Got a lot of stone, a lot of wood. Let's make ourselves some boxes, but we're gonna need some frags for that. I wish we already have actually from that dude, but I'm just gonna make myself a normal small box for now. We really need to get a furnace, man. Once we get ourselves a furnace, then we're gonna smell everything we have. And we're gonna try to get this base to full metal. Alright, so I'm gonna put everything that I don't wanna lose in here, and we're gonna go to a farming run. This time in a monument, though. Alright boys, back in base. Pretty good run. A lot of junk, but we got ourselves our first furnace. So I'll just put that bad boy. Uh, we can put it right over there, looks nice. And we're gonna start smelting as much metal as possible. Great! Alright, so our lighthouse, time to start. Scrapping everything we don't need. We could actually keep the pipes, but for now, it doesn't really matter. But yeah, hopefully from this we'll get ourselves as much metal as possible. Yeah, we got some HQM. Lovely. Oh man, I think I lost it, bro. Sorry, I'm gonna get back to base. It's gonna be dark and we're gonna wait during the night on our base. Oh, there's an animal right over there, actually. Yeah, I'm not gonna risk that, though. They'll definitely destroy me. It's a pack. Alright, so during the night I actually worked a lot on the base, upgraded it heavily, farmed some wood as well, but hopefully I have enough wood, yeah. Oh yeah, we actually may. Alright, lovely. Great, beautiful. Yeah, we still need to do this. But over here I'm gonna do like one by ones. I think it'll look cool. I don't think I ever saw this design before, we still need more wood. Though. Also made myself another room where it's gonna be a loot room. It's probably not really a smart base type, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, we're out of wood. I'm gonna continue farm more then. Alright, so we got ourselves a workbench over here. We're gonna start learning uh, some stuff until we get ourselves something that we can research it later. But for now, we'll keep that right over there. Alright, so I think next we're gonna go on another monument run. Alright, he's dead. Please, something good. Oh, okay. Not really. Let's check out what these stuff over here have. We could harvest him as well. Get cloth.
Yeah! Alright, Naito, we made it back in base. Not bad. I'm just gonna wait until it's day. As always, man. Got ourselves some pretty good runs from this. Got ourselves some food. Tech trash. So I don't complain. Clock, clock. What? He's not dead? Close the door, man. Reload. Thank God I came with the shotgun this time. There you go. He's dead. And he had... Oh, ammo. Alright, not bad. Destroyed. Anything good, Bucko? Pistol ammo. I'll take that. And we could use the recycler now, finally. Crate here, so... Yeah, nothing that good. Alright, let's start recycling. I made it back to base, a pretty good run. Already depoted. To kill myself because I was low. Got myself green and blue card already too. Which is uh, pretty nice, I may actually try to use them very soon. Wait, somebody already turned it on. Oh, they were here like a few minutes ago. Oh, we gotta be careful actually. I'm only here with a bow and a knife, man. But I'm gonna wait for it 100%. Uh, what? what? Somebody died here, man. Yo, double barrel pickaxe, a bunch of scrap, some high quality. Yo, blue card, a hazmat suit as well. I will actually not complain. The guy that started hacking this computer, he must have died to like an animal or like something, man. That's hilarious. Yeah, this is exactly how a 50 hour solo Rex reaches. He gets lucky, man. He's probably gonna come back too, that's the thing. Hopefully he lives far. Oh yeah, there's a guy coming. Yeah, it must be the same guy. Hit him. He's running saying the n-word, bro. He's dead. Imagine he came with insane loot. Man, shut up. Yep, just saying the n-word, bro. Yeah, he's dead. My guy brought me cloth. Honestly, I don't blame him. He's gonna be that mad. He died to probably an animal. He lost this crate. Let's just harvest him. Yeah, time's almost up. Still waiting. One. The goat's open and... Okay. Yo, C4 LR. Face masks. Holy... Oh my god. Bro, that's crazy. Alright, let's dump the stuff we don't need. We're definitely taking that. PC, pipes. Yeah, we don't need the rest. Alright, now we're gonna run to base. And LR is insane, man. And C4 on full vanilla. Crazy. Alright, so I think it's like night 5, uh, learning a lot, already got pump shotgun, shells for it, salvaged picks and salvage axe, already all done. And I'm gonna crop myself a little bit of pump shotguns. Now, I've been farming for quite a bit, went around the map quite a number of times as well, and it's currently dark and I can't see anything, this is not really good, man. Still running around with bow for now, until I get myself like a few pump shotguns. Yeah, I need to make torches. I could just kill myself and get the torch automatically. Yeah, it's so dark, man. I can't see anything, bro. Booty shot. My guy just flipped all over the wall. What? Alright, another crate spawned and we're gonna start hacking. I think it takes like a, an hour between one and another, dude. It takes a while. I'm here with an alarm in case anybody decides to show up. Uh, in the meantime, I'm gonna kill the scientists. Hope for some good stuff from them, actually. Yeah, they're already shooting at me, bro. I can try to kill them with the ball, to be honest, to not waste ammo, but... Yeah, he's just shooting at me, bro. Where did he go? Yeah, he's still there. Let's see what loot they had. Uh, rifle ammo. I'll take that. I don't even know what these things are. Now, uh, we could wait here by the recycler, actually. For these 15 minutes, I think we will get a pretty good angle on them. I don't even know where I killed the second scientist. Oh, there he is. Ah, uh, more rifle ammo. Lovely. Okay, we got... The ammo that we had, then plus more. So I won't complain. Alright, there's heli outside. Wait, what? Oh. What? Why am I dead, man? <laughs> nah. Okay, this is actually terrible. How did it see me through? Okay, I, I know that it's like the attack helicopter. And I know that if I have a gun. But I did not think that it would actually shoot me through uh, a building. But it's fine, we'll just run back. 
Alright, opened, lovely, and... Okay, um... Another C4! <laughs> what? Some clothes, pipes, incendiary... I mean, that C4 is lovely. We got ourselves an M39, so... So... Huge! Alright. Let's run back to base. Alright, back in base, lovely run. Can't complain. Huge! We're actually getting, like, my goal to, was to get high-tier guns. Just from this run. I did do a lot of farming. We do have a lot of crates. Even though a lot of them are like half full. Get ourselves the scrap. I'm pretty sure I have more scrap lying around. I just don't exactly know where. Probably in our TC. Yep. A lot more scrap. I think we can learn something with that now. We have ourselves a research or we have ourselves a research table. So we could put that in this room over here. Let's close that. Back there we can do like a, a furnace. I'm gonna try to learn the incendiary, basically. We need 125, we could do that, but we need a workbench level 3. So I'm just gonna do it, once we get ourselves a level 3, then bam, easy. Easy raiding gear, racks to riches. Takes a while, actually, for it to, to work. But I do think we did progress quite quickly. I mean, it took me around a few hours to get this loot. Yeah, we do need level 3, and we do need, uh, like, gunpowder mainly. Nothing that crazy, man. I really hope that you guys did enjoy. If you guys want to see more Rust videos in the future where we can continue on the server as well, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!